Each day, over 6,000 thoughts travel through our brain. So no wonder it's easy to get distracted when brain signals travel to our muscles at over 100 miles per hour. That's where the N10 headphones come in. Created by a company called Nearable, these headphones claim to help you focus. They have brainwave sensors built into the ear cups that will understand when you're off task and help you adjust to get refocused. And to go a step further, if you get a phone call, you can simply wink or nod to accept or decline the call. That's some crazy stuff, but there's already a bunch of headphones that claim to help you focus. So will the N10 headphones be the next best seller or fall flat on their face? Today we'll find out on Tech Boom Videos. Building a world without limits. That's Nearable's goal with all of their products. They started off by using a headset lined with electrodes to allow people to move objects around in virtual worlds by just thinking about it. But that wasn't a product Nearable felt could fully reach the market that they were going after. So they came up with a pair of headphones and they had help from some of the smartest people in neuroscience from universities like Stanford, Harvard, Brown, MIT, and a lot more. But just having a bunch of smart people doesn't guarantee they're able to make something that'll help people be more productive. So this is what they came up with, the N10 headphones. These headphones will cost $400. That's not too far off of Sony's top of the line headphones for $350 or Bose's best offering for $380. But those headphones just cancel noise to help you focus. These read your brain. That's why Nearable's co-founder Adam Molnar doesn't see his company competing with other headphone brands like Bose and Sony. It's like comparing a Rolex to an Apple Watch. You wouldn't wear them for the same thing. But if Nearable isn't competing with the headphone market, they have got to be really good at helping people focus. So how do these headphones know you're off task and how do they help you focus? If you have a measure, an estimation of attention, because there isn't actually a measure of attention, then what you can do with that is that you can start to look at what music helps keep you in the best workspace. What locations are you doing your best work? What time of day are you doing your best work? Not just when are you getting distracted, but by how much? And then what are you doing to help bring you back to a performance level? So even though there's no true measure of focus, the headphones can read electrical signals given off by your brain and turn it into a graph. The higher the blue line, the more focused you are. Then Nearable can change the music you're listening to or suggest ways to focus better based on you specifically. And to prove that their software can really tell if you're focused or not, they put an intern through a series of Stroop tasks. Stroop tasks are like when the word green is written in red or the word blue is written in black. It takes an incredible amount of focus to do all on Stroop tasks. And this is what the graph looked like from that test. There's a huge difference in measured focus when he's distracted. And each time he got distracted, it took 10 to 15 seconds to gain focus again. That's why Nearable is not only set on accurately measuring brain activity, but proving they can interpret it into useful suggestions to help your focus. Their product is really just software. The headphones are called N10 because of the Spanish word entender, which means to understand. Anyone can create headphones that sound good and cancel noise. Sony and Bose could even put brainwave sensors on their headphones, but that's all useless without a way to interpret the data that's collected. To them, it's not about having sensors that collect brain data, it's being able to make something useful out of the data that they collect. And the headphones aren't bad either, they have good sound, good noise cancellation, Bluetooth 5.0, and all the other stuff. This is supposed to be a breakthrough in focus in the form of headphones that sound great, cancel noise, and respect your privacy. But you'll have to wait until 2022 to get your hands on a pair. They ship to early backers starting May 2022. So while Nearable changed the way we work and reached the masses with its $400 price tag, only time will tell, but comment what you think about the N10 headphones down below and comment any questions you have. Thank you guys for watching the first ever episode of Tech Balloon Mini Docs. If you really enjoyed it, please make sure to help this reach as many people as possible by hitting the like button and commenting if you're gonna buy the N10 headphones yourself.